Chapter 2 What is the purpose of spirituality? Maharaj The purpose of spirituality is to know oneself in a real sense, erase illusion and dissolve all body knowledge. Listen again. The purpose of spirituality is to know oneself in a real sense, erase illusion and dissolve all body knowledge. We must know what the purpose of human life is and what exactly it is that we want. We must know. Human beings are endowed with intellect so we can find out. You are interested in spirituality. You are searching, seeking, so you come here looking. What are you looking for? What do you want? I want happiness, is often the reply. Everybody wants happiness. We need peace. A fearless life. A tension-free life. You will not find what you are looking for from external sources. Here you will listen to and rediscover your own knowledge, your own spontaneous knowledge. Your invisible spontaneous presence is the source of your happiness. Everything is within you, but you are unaware of that. Your presence is an open secret. Your presence does not need anything. Therefore, who wants peace? Who wants happiness. Your spontaneous presence is unknown to itself. Your spontaneous presence is silent, anonymous, invisible, unidentified identity. After years of spirituality, have you reached a conclusion? Book reading alone is not enough. It is dry knowledge, material knowledge. For whom are you reading all these books? You are formless. You are ultimate truth. You are not the body. You were not the body. You're not going to remain the body. This is to be your conviction. The only way of establishing this conviction is through meditation and self-inquiry. Forget about spirituality for a moment. The body is not your identity because it undergoes change. The body has a time limit. Open fact. One day it will be buried or burned. The unknown came into existence and became known through the body. The unknown came to be known. The known will be absorbed in the unknown. Simple teachings. When the spontaneous presence came into existence in body form, pain started. Physical pain and mental pain. Spirituality gives you the courage to face pain Attachment and loss are causes of pain. 
psychological problems, emotional problems, all of these body disturbances will dissolve with the help of meditation. Nidhargadatta Maharaj says, Though you may have good knowledge, good spiritual knowledge, the only way this knowledge can be absorbed is with the help of meditation. Prior to beingness, there was no body, no problems and no needs. No language, no words, no concepts. You had no need of food, no need of knowledge, no need of spirituality. There was no master, no disciple and no need of realisation. You had no name, no wife, no husband, no mother, no father, no brother, no sister, no friend. All relations are body related. The world is the spontaneous projection of your spontaneous presence. This is direct knowledge. It is not an intellectual approach, not a logical approach, not an egoistic approach, as all these things came after your presence. You are here to know yourself in a real sense, to know reality. For this to happen spontaneously, you have to erase everything that you are not with the help of self-inquiry, meditation, and knowledge from the Master. You were never in bondage. You are free as a bird. You have just forgotten your identity. The Master is here to remind you. You are ultimate truth ultimate reality, final truth. You are Almighty God. You are everything and everything is within you.